Hello and welcome back to Body Bags. I'm your host for Thursday evening, the Sinister One. And today I will be bringing you another review. But before I get on with my review, I would like to give a shout out to Marnie, who was a part of the Body Bags channel while I was on this and still am she was a big part of this channel she put out a lot of great reviews a lot of great horror genre films but life always gets in the way of things everyone's busy constantly with their own channels and life in general she will be missed but she has her own channel so go please subscribe to her channel if you will, you'll be doing me a favor, personally, as well as her and everyone else in the horror genre community and the 22 Shots of Moods, as well as the Body Bags family. So, Carly will be taking her spot, and we should all welcome her with arms wide open as well as head trimmers. So, on that note, I was working late today. What can I say? You know, end of the year, December, it's hectic. You know, I haven't had time to watch a decent horror genre film. I got them stacked up, you know, to the heavens, but... Just don't have any time. So, I'm sifting through some of my uh, collection. Recent buys. Purchases, if you will. And I found one that I say, hey, I'll do a review. Late night review, like always. Hey. But, Monster Vision. I always stayed up for Joe Bob Briggs. So, this may not be technically a horror film, but it's a great film, and I think maybe it might be a cult classic someday. But, nonetheless, I'm going to give you a review on this film. And that film is... Maps to the Stars. A film by David Cronenberg with uh, John Cusack and Julian Moore, Robert Patterson, who starred in another. Cronenberg film that I have, but I, I haven't watched it yet. And I saw this one at my local uh, cult theater, The Loft, in Tucson, Arizona. They play these type of films, you know, Independence. They got Mondo Mondays, you know, the Rocky Horror Picture Show every second Saturday of the month, and what have you, you know. So I was like, Cronenberg with this cast I was like I have to go see this and I have to say I was really really impressed you know it's it's a very dark morbid film and I think by that there's a lot of horror in it you know there's a lot of a lot of deceit and disgust greed and sin and I am the sinister one so that's why I chose to bring you this review but anyways I'll give you the whole synopsis on this thing let's see in this unforgettable darkly comic thriller from a 
acclaimed director David Cronenberg, Hollywood actress Havana Sagrand is unraveling as her career wanders. Her therapist and his wife are busy managing the career of their child star son. But when a mysterious young woman named Agatha befriends a limo driver and ties all their lives together, nothing will ever be the same as they try to survive a world of money, fame, envy, and relentless hauntings. So, Maps to the Stars. You know, I wanted to say four stars. Julianne Moore just kills this role. Um, Sean Cusack. I'm sorry, but I love him to death. All his films, great. He can play anything from good to evil. And everything in between. So check out Maps to the Stars. I'm your host, the Sinister One. And I'll be seeing you next time.